you, your body can adjust. That's one thing I think we're discounting here in the whole doom and gloom conspiracy movement is the human spirit. And the human spirit is almost miraculous. And I think there's going to be some miracles happening through this deterioration. And I don't think we need to focus on the negative anymore. I think we can focus on the positive and have a real positive experience. I mean, you're going to die someday. Well, see, Why focus on death and destruction now? That is so true. And, um, you know, let's face it. I mean, yeah, you're going to die someday, George. And I'm going to die someday. Yeah. But you know what the thing is, is? Am I going to live, you know, an isolated lifestyle? Am I going to separate myself, in a sense, from society by, you know, being a wolf? No, I can cohabitate with the sheep in this world by being a guard dog. And guess what? I'm accepted because I'm a guard dog and not a wolf. So people aren't looking at me. You know, like I said, I'm not going around and I'm not, you know, posting videos with all my guns and this and that and all that. Yeah. I'm just a normal guy, dude. I'm a normal guy that chooses to be educated, that chooses to be informed. I make my deci decisions. You go on Facebook, you have a it, ton of friends. Exactly, you yeah. You go out, meet people. Yeah. And uh, you don't, you're not closing yourself, you're not closing yourself off. You're opening yourself to other people and you're not, you know, it's not like this insanity, sanity thing. That That's exactly correct. You know, I, I have peace of mind. You know, I have lightness of heart, and because I'm not letting that negativity assume me, I mean, uh, consume, consume me, you. but yet, you know, I'm not discounting that there's that crap out there. I'm not discounting that the dollar is getting bad, you know, is deteriorating. I'm not discounting the economic crisis that we're going through right now. I'm saying, dude, that's there, but guess what? You don't have to be bummed and doomed and, and, and feel like you're defeated and all that. And the way you do that is by empowering yourself and by giving yourself the skills to survive. And, and that's the problem, I think, guys, is we've, there's a whole industry built on this whole thing. And I trust me, I've been a part of it. I've seen it from the inside. And I think everyone's just getting a little too carried away with all this, you know. Fear. It's, it's too much, it's too much fear. It's too much negativity. And I'm just saying you're going to, I mean, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end up shooting myself in the head if I keep going this way. Yeah, you know, it's all right to be afraid. You know, it, it, it is completely all right to be afraid. But, you know, put yourself in a position to come out at the end of the tunnel, you know. Be, put yourself in a position to come out, you know, and, and survive and thrive in, 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 you know, deteriorating circumstances. And if you always... So I guess what we're promoting with Ron here is the idea, the concept of being a guard dog, not... Correct. Not yeah. a wolf. Correct. Yeah. Because guess what? Wolves turn on wolves, dude, and all that, you know, um, and that's what people need to understand is that you can still be positive, but still be informed. You can still be, you know, educated and still know what's going on in this world, but it doesn't mean you have to shut everyone else out as well. And we're not saying one is bad, one is good. We're just, we're talking about the whole concept. And it's like, Correct. do you want to be a wolf? Do you want to be a guard dog? Do you want to be a sheep? You know, not to judge them, just to deal with the situation that's in front of you. And I think, personally, I think there's too much negativity, too much negative news. And now we are becoming the, we are, we are committing the same sin that the mainstream media is. I mean, we're focusing on, on the whole freaking fear thing just for the fact of focusing on, on it. And number one, it's not working anymore because people won't sustain themselves. And um, that's why I'm moving forward and I'm turning over a new leaf. And I'm glad, I'm, I'm becoming more like this guy. Yeah, because it's true. It's like we talked about, you know, earlier today, you know, the whole, uh, you know, you call bullshit after a certain while, you know, being involved in a certain movement or certain this and certain that, you know, you kind of really see what the true intentions are, you know, and all that. And yeah, I was talking with Ron about that when I went down, I mean, I was financed to go down to Mexico to do a story on H1N1. The story they wanted was death, destruction, everything. I went there, I talked to people, I looked around, and you know what I saw? I saw bullshit. It was total, absolute lie. And when I reported that, the people that financed it didn't like it, didn't want to hear that, but that was the truth. And that's what I'm having to call today on the conspiracy, well, you know, I'm just going to call it what it is. I'm not totally knowledgeable on all the conspiracies, but I can call it on the doom and gloom. I'm calling bullshit on everything we're doing, and it needs to change. Yes, you're right, because, you know, doom and gloom, you know, works on a fear perspective. You know, it works on the fact that, ooh, oh, the, the world's ending. You know what? And I'm not discounting the negative things that are happening in, in today's economy again and in life in general. Because it's bad, and it's, everything's right. bad. And it's yeah. like when everything's bad, it's just like... You know, it, the model of being afraid doesn't work. Correct. So what are you going to do? You're going to sit and you're, you're going to be afraid and not do anything about it? Or 
are you gonna push through that fear? Because it debilitates you. Correct, or are you gonna push through that fear, take the steps, take the motion, to be informed, to be educated, to provide yourself with the means to survive. And have courage. And have courage. And be positive. Correct, and be positive. So that's the message, guys. Be a guard dog, not a sheep, not a wolf. Be positive, move forward. Let's do this, let's figure it out together. G for T, Ron, 90 for 10. Peace. Peace.